All right, what's going on, everybody? Welcome back to another video. I'm pissed off already since I have to re-record this video, and because the other one did not decide to record my audio. Can you hear me now? Um, yeah, finished the whole damn cup, and now I have to um, re-record this shit. We're playing on this one right here, Acorn Cup. Fuck. <laughs> God damn it. Uh, and also, I ended up losing in the last race. That's why I have two stars. Oh, this is so annoying, dude. Why? There's a whole other 15 minutes I could have used to record the last episode. But no, I have to re-record this one. So, add another 30 minutes into me recording something I already recorded. That's bullshit, dude. Sometimes, man, I hate technology. I, I liked it back in the day, back in 2005 at least. At least it would make more sense. Like, if technology did not work back in 2005, at least it, it had a reason why it did not work. It wasn't that advanced. Ain't no way in hell I'm letting those fucking two stars be on my, uh, on my profile. Fuck that. I'm better than that shit. And you're probably wondering how I got fucked over in the last race. I was literally this close to the damn race, or like me finishing up. I was telling the story, and uh, yeah, of course, a damn fucking blue shell just comes out of nowhere, right? Even though I recently got hit by a damn turtle, and everyone's like literally right behind me. But how in the fuck does that happen, dude? Like, what the fuck? This shit's annoying. And then when I go back and look at the damn video, I was listening to it, I was like, what the fuck is going on? It sounds like I'm, like, talking underwater or something. It sounds like I'm trying to, like, speak and freaking breathe at the same time. It's, it sounds fucking weird. It sounds like I'm, like, a kid with fucking asthma or something. What the fuck? There we go. Oh, wow. It's so, oh, yeah. Now it counts. Yeah, it sounded like I was, like, fucking out of breath or something. That's bullshit, though. I did not deserve that fucking loss at that last damn second. Like, I was literally on the line. I was literally on the damn line. I was on the checkered freaking line, dude. How? And then, uh, I forgot who it was. I think it was Lemmy. That bastard. That guy. So, I was literally, like, on the line, right? And... I get, I get shoved over, you know? I get pushed over, and I get second place. Like, what the fuck is that, dude? That's bullshit. I am pissed off beyond repair right now, dude. It's so much bullshit. It's not even bullshit. It's horse shit. It's horse... It's horse... Horse bull. Bull horse shit. That's both bull horse and shit. It's bullshit. It's all of them. It's, it's cat feces. It's all, all of them. All the feces in the world that you can think of. It's all for fucking bullshit, dude. It's fucking all of them at the same time. It's fucking cat piss, bull, bullshit, horse shit. Um, dog piss, dog shit, it's all of them. And, and what sucks is I have to re-record this, so it's, it's not authentic anymore at this point. It's already played these maps already once, but the recording messed up. That's what bothers me. It's not, like, I can't 
talk about the stories I was well I could I was talking about how um, I, I was I don't know I feel like eating a burger or something look at this bullshit dude look we're already starting this I'm gonna drop over here that way it doesn't affect me never mind I was talking about how I wanted to uh, eat a burger right I was in the mood for a burger and uh, I was telling myself should I go to the store or should I go to a fast food joint you know just pass through the drive-thru tell them what I want and that'd be over or go to the store and buy myself the beef patty and uh, prepare it myself, season it myself, all that stuff. And then I thought, damn, that's a lot of fucking work. Fuck that. I mean, that's what they call the fast food, right? So I don't know. I, I don't know what I'm going to do. You know, since we're uh, here recording the videos and shit, you know, there's one thing that really, really, really bothers me from on this platform are the people that fake videos and are scammers and they do a bunch of like dumbass shit, right? But somehow they are still relevant. As in for someone that, like me, you know, it's coming up or it's not relevant in the scene. They do that, they're canceled automatically. They're just shadow banned, right? The reason that bothers me is because there's people on this platform that actually give a fuck. And they put in so much time and effort and, you know, a lot of it, you know. They, they sacrifice a lot of things to get get to where they want to be but they, they never get there because there's these other flashy ass motherfuckers on here that do all these crazy ass things right and they're somehow still relevant people still actually give a fuck about them even though they've been scammed out of money out of uh or they've done some like really controversial stuff yeah i've said some controversial stuff on this channel before i'm not saying that i'm not gonna deny that i'm not i'm not being hip hypocritical but I'm just saying that how in the hell are these people still relevant you know what I mean like it, it just makes no fucking sense to me it's like people like critiquing these people and keeping them relevant on the scene it, it just it boggles my mind and also for like many of these guys that like support these uh young ladies out here that like exposing themselves and give them their whole damn paycheck and they're just they're not giving out any content yeah I'm calling you people out I'm calling you guys out too the people actually support that like young men like myself that fall into like these thirst traps right like come on man come on bro uh, don't don't give these ladies your money like they don't care like why are you doing that do yourself a favor, man. Instead of spending $20 on that subscription, bro, go outside, go hang out with your friends. It doesn't even have to be with your friends. If you uh, if you don't have any friends, go to the park, run around for a little bit, exercise. Treat yourself to a good time. Go to the movie theaters by yourself. Go walk around the mall by yourself. Go buy yourself a snack. Go buy yourself a nice burger or something. Do anything else. Go to the park. I don't know. Do anything else than spend those $20. Go for a drive. Go listen to some music. Go meet new people. Go be social. Hell, start a YouTube channel and talk to yourself like I do. I mean, most of the time. Like, But don't, don't be giving these people... Unless they're like 
ladies out there actually create content, like gaming content, vlogs, or whatever, if you support them, that's fine. If they're actually putting out decent content, but if you're like giving money to these girls or half naked on your screen, and come on, bro, have some self respect. You know what I mean? Like, come on, man. And besides, there's like free websites out there that already do that for you. But you're out here supporting a chick that does that shit. You know what I mean? Now, you're probably wondering, would I ever date a girl that does that? And it, would I give her permission? First of all, it's it's her choice. You know what I mean? I'm not going to be out here telling her what to do. Say if I'm married, right? If I'm married and my wife does that, and and I'm, I'm, I'm okay with that, that's fine, right? But, obviously, if I wasn't fine with it, I wouldn't be with her. And, it, you know what I mean? It would be irrelevant. If you're not okay with something, just, uh, you know, let her go, right? And, obviously, you would not be married to that person. That would just be a waste of everyone's time, but... Basically, what I'm trying to say is that, like, come on, man, <laughs> just uh, have some self-respect, have some self-decency, and also for those other content creators that do some crazy-ass shit, do some crazy stuff, people that scam you, I'm not on here to scam people, man. I'm not here to take your money. I'm not here to uh, do any harm. Everything I do on this channel is for, just for entertainment purposes only. Uh, I'm just a guy out here trying to document his life. Just playing video games to talk about stuff. Raw and honest as possible. Um, yeah, you know. It might not get me a lot of views, but hey, at least I'm being honest with myself and I can sleep at night knowing that what I'm putting out, I'm happy with and no one's getting scammed. I mean, other than that, I'm only taking your time, but we're all wasting time on this planet, right? I'm wasting time to have fun, share my experiences Whatever experience I have, I'm still young. I still got a lot of things to learn. By no means I'm a god and know what the hell I'm saying or what I'm doing or have like every single answer. In the... Look at this bullshit, bro. Look at that bullshit. I got hit by a freaking red shell and then a blue shell. Like, what the hell is that? Yeah, by no means I have like every single answer to the book. I'm not saying I know everything. I'm not a wise man or anything. Well, some people have actually said I'm really wise. So I'm like really quiet. I don't know. I'm a really social person. Like I've said before, I've said this billions of times already on the channel. I'm a really social person. I don't mind talking to people. I don't mind talking in front of a large groups of people. I don't mind starting up a conversation. But it feels like I'm always the one that starts up the conversation. I need someone else to step up to the plate and actually come up to me. And be like, hey, how you doing? You know, say hi, good morning, smile, or something. I feel like I'm always on a, the one that has to do that stuff. And I want someone else to step up. Step out of their comfort zone. And say, hey. You know? That's personally how I feel about it. But I'm not shy or anything. I make mistakes. I stumble over my words from time to time. It makes me human. And I, like I said, at the end of the day, I sleep well knowing that I am being myself. I, I'm not trying to bullshit anyone. That was the last race, why? I think, right? I don't. I don't remember. I forgot to show you guys where I got screwed over. But it was like right there on that freaking line where the freaking... So I got hit by a shell like a couple meters out from that line. 
and then the fucking blue shell. As soon as I, I recover from that red shell, the fucking piece of shit just fucks me over. And then since I'm on that line, still I'm not one to race yet, this other motherfucker comes from behind and just fucks me over. That's bullshit, dude. It was so much bullshit. And this uh, video probably got demonetized or something. I don't know. It doesn't matter. The amount of times I've said bullshit. So yeah. Fuck you too to the people that are really soft at YouTube as well. And also have a great day. If you guys enjoyed, I'll see you guys on the last episode. Later.